Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we have a gripping and informative topic to discuss. The top 10 types of cyber crimes that have shaken the digital world. Whether you are a cyber security enthusiast or just curious about the darker side of the internet. This video is for you. Cyber crime is evolving rapidly and understanding the most prevalent threats is crucial for your online safety. In this video, we will uncover the top 10 types of cyber crimes that have made headlines. From massive data breaches to sophisticated hacking operations. And if you are an aspiring cybersecurity professional looking for online training and certifications from prestigious universities and in collaboration with leading experts to enhance your credibility, then search no more. Simply Learn's postgraduate program in cybersecurity from MIT University in collaboration with EC Council should be your right choice. The course is designed to accommodate a diverse range of learners. And this course requires just a bachelor's degree with a 50% average and no prior programming experience and one plus year of work experience is preferred. For more details, use the link in the description box below. So let's dive right in and explore the world of cybercrime with a countdown of the top 10 types of cybercrimes. Starting with number 1, Data Breaches. A data breach is a significant security incident where unauthorized access, retrieval or disclosure of sensitive or confidential information occurs. These breaches can have severe consequences, including financial losses, reputation damage and privacy violations. Cyber criminals exploit vulnerabilities in computer systems or networks to gain access to personal, financial or business data. Common examples involve stolen login credentials, credit card details or personal information. Organizations invest heavily in cybersecurity measures to prevent data breaches, but they remain a persistent threat in the digital age. Timely detection and response are essential to mitigate the impact of these breaches and safeguard sensitive information. Number 2. Ransomware Attacks Ransomware attacks are malicious cyber incidents where hackers encrypt a victim's data and demand a ransom in exchange for the decryption key. These attacks can cripple organizations, locking them out of critical systems and sensitive information. The attackers typically demand payment in cryptocurrencies to maintain anonymity. Ransomware has evolved into a lucrative criminal enterprise targeting businesses, hospitals and even individuals. The consequences of a successful ransomware attack can be devastating, leading to data loss, financial loss and reputational damage. Preventative measures such as regular backups, robust cybersecurity and employee training are essential to mitigate the risk of falling victim to ransomware. Now moving to third one, that is phishing scams. Phishing scams are deceptive tactics employed by cyber criminals to trick individuals into revealing sensitive information such as passwords, credit card details or personal data. Typically, phishing involves fraudulent emails, messages or websites that impersonate legitimate entities like banks or reputable organizations. The aim is to lure victims into clicking on malicious links or providing confidential information. When successful, hackers can exploit this data for financial gain or identity theft. Phishing is a prevalent and ever-evolving threat in the digital world, emphasizing the importance of awareness and caution when interacting with online communication to safeguard personal and financial information. Now coming to the next one, Identity Theft. Identity theft is a serious cybercrime where an individual's personal information such as their name, social security number or financial data is stolen and fraudulently used by cyber criminals. Perpetrators often use this stolen identity for financial gain, including assessing bank accounts, applying for loans or making unauthorized purchases. The consequences for victims can be devastating, including financial loss, damaged credit scores and emotional distress. Preventive measures like strong passwords, monitoring financial accounts and being cautious with personal information online are essential to protect oneself from identity theft in today's digitally connected world. And the next is DDoS attacks. A distributed denial of service, DDoS attack is a malicious attempt to disrupt the regular functioning of a network, website or online services by overwhelming it with a flood of traffic from multiple sources. In a DDoS attack, a large number of compromised devices, often part of a botnet, are used to send an excessive amount of requests or data to the target, causing it to become inaccessible to legitimate users. These attacks can have severe consequences, including downtime, financial losses and damage to reputation. Mitigation techniques such as traffic filtering and content delivery networks are essential to defend against DDoS attacks and ensure the continued availability of online services. 
and coming to the next online fraud online fraud refers to various deceptive activities conducted over the internet with the intention of gaining financial advantage at the expense of victims it encompasses a wide range of schemes including identity theft credit card fraud and phishing scams perpetrators often employ sophisticated techniques to trick individuals and organizations into divulging sensitive information or making unauthorized financial transactions online fraud can lead to severe financial losses and personal data breaches making it a significant concern for internet users and businesses alike to protect oneself it's crucial to remain cautious verify sources and employ robust security measures when engaging in online transactions or sharing personal information now coming to the next Cyber espionage. Cyber espionage is the covert and unauthorized infiltration of computer systems and networks with the intent to gather sensitive information, often for political, economic, or military purposes. Perpetrated by nation states, cyber espionage involves sophisticated tactics like malware, phishing, and hacking to access classified data, trade secrets, or government intelligence. The stolen information can be exploited to gain a competitive advantage or espionage activities. It poses a significant threat to nation security and global stability, necessitating constant vigilance and cybersecurity measures to counter these clandestine attacks in the digital realm. Now coming to the next, crypto jacking. Crypto jacking is a malicious practice where cyber criminals covertly hijack a victim's computer or devices processing power to mine cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin or Monero. This is typically done without the user's consent or knowledge, slowing down the device and increasing energy consumption. Crypto jacking can occur through infected websites, malicious software downloads, or compromised ads. The mined cryptocurrency goes directly to the attacker's wallet. It's a profitable yet illegal activity that poses a significant threat to both individuals and organizations. To protect against crypto jacking, users should use reputable antivirus software and regularly update their systems to patch vulnerabilities that could be exploited by crypto jackers. Now coming to the next, that is social engineering. Social engineering is a deceptive tactic used by cyber criminals to manipulate individuals or organizations into divulging confidential information or performing actions against their best interest. This psychological manipulation preys on human trust and emotions. It can take various forms such as phishing emails, impersonation, pretexting or baiting. Social engineers often use convincing pretext to trick their targets into revealing sensitive data such as passwords or financial details. It's a critical aspect of cybersecurity awareness to recognize and resist these manipulative tactics as social engineering attacks remain a prevalent and effective method for hackers to breach cybersecurity systems and compromise personal or corporate data. Now coming to the next, deepfakes and manipulated content. Deepfakes and manipulated content refer to the alarming phenomena where artificial intelligence and advanced software are used to create highly convincing but entirely fabricated videos, audio recordings, or images. These deceptive media pieces often superimpose on person likeliness onto another, making it appear as though they are saying or doing things they never did. Deepfakes have raised significant concerns about misinformation, privacy, and the potential to deceive the public. As technology advances, the ability to detect and combat deepfakes becomes increasingly critical in preserving trust and authenticity in the digital age. And this was all for this tutorial. Hope you guys found it informative and helpful. There you have it, the top 10 types of cyber crimes that have shaped the digital landscape. Stay tuned for more insights into cybersecurity and don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video with anyone interested in staying safe online. Remember knowledge is power when it comes to protecting yourself in the digital age. Stay vigilant, stay informed and stay secure. If you are an aspiring cybersecurity professional looking for online training and certifications from prestigious universities and in collaboration with leading experts to enhance your credibility, then search no more. Simply Learn's Advanced Executive Program in Cybersecurity in collaboration with NPCI should be your right choice. With this program, you can transform your career in six months for India's specific region only. And this course provides a high engagement learning experience with real world applications and is designed for individuals who want to start a new and more fulfilling career. And now let's take a minute to hear from our learners who have experienced massive success in their careers by opting out Simply Learn courses. Hi, I'm Philip. I'm 61 years old and last year I upskilled with Simply Learn's postgraduate program in cybersecurity after working 30 years in the IT sector in various different profiles. I'm happy to tell you that I was able to clear and pass my CISSP and CCSP certification exams on the first attempt after 
taking the course. The course, I must say, was packed with practical examples. It was led by highly skilled, certified instructors with many companies before as a, as a security analyst and an architect on a contract basis. But I needed some stability, which I got with the job I just started with Infosys as a cybersecurity consultant. Happened on a first. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more from Simply Learn. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.